If like many other people you're considering using 5G to get online at home instead of your normal internet connection, you might be wondering what sorts of speeds you can get with 5G technology. The speeds you get with 5G depend on a number of different factors, the most important of which is the 5G coverage of your address. First, put your postcode into the website of a few different mobile networks. This is the first step you'll need to take to verify that you actually can get 5G broadband at your address. On the website, you're looking for the map to show that you can get good indoor and outdoor 5G coverage. Since these coverage maps don't give a speed estimate, the best way to figure out what speeds you'll actually get is to do a test. There are a few different ways to do this. If you have a 5G phone, or can borrow one, turn off Wi-Fi and do a few different speed tests in different parts of the house using an app like speedtest.net. If you're considering using a 5G router, a 5G phone can give you a good indication of the sorts of speeds you'll receive. If you can't get your hands on a 5G phone, you can buy a 5G router that comes with a return policy. For example, in the UK, the 3 5G hub router comes with a 14 day money back guarantee. You can use the device and as long as it's not damaged, return it within 2 weeks. This is a good way to see what sorts of speeds you receive with a 5G router. When we tested the 5G hub, we found that we could get download speeds of about 250 to 300 megabits per second, with a latency of about 40 milliseconds. Our upload speed was decent, but not amazing at about 10 to 15 megabits per second. You might be able to get faster speeds than what we achieved, especially if you live in an urban area. The theoretical maximum download speed of most 5G routers is 2 gigabits per second on most 5G networks. Once you get a 5G router, there are a number of things you can do to improve your download speeds. The first thing to do is ensure that you put the 5G router in the best place for it. Normally, this is an upstairs windowsill, but it can vary from household to household. Most 5G routers have a tool in their settings to help you test signal strength in different parts of the house and find the best place to put the device. Once you've found the best place to put your router, try and point it in different directions. This can also have a big impact on the 5G signal strength you receive. To learn more about 5G home broadband routers, including how they work and the speeds they offer, you can read our guide to the 3 5G Hub, which is the first link in the description. 